Hi guys, welcome to my channel IT Support People. This is Masood. Today I'll show you how to connect Cisco router using party and console cable and how to change text color, font size and background color on party. So let's get started. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you will be notified about the all the latest video which I'll create in future. Now I'll show you how to connect the console cable from uh, router's console port to the PC's uh, or laptop's USB port. Here you can see that uh, this is a console cable. It has uh, uh, the one end is uh, RJ45 uh, connector. You can see this is a RJ45 connector which will uh, go to the console port of the router and the other end is a uh, db9 uh, serial port is a db9 uh, uh, female serial port uh, which will uh, go to the laptop or pc so basically the new laptop uh, laptops have uh, no uh, serial port so we need another adapter to connect the serial port uh, this is a, a serial to USB adapter. Uh, we need uh, this adapter to connect the serial port. Uh, this is a male uh, serial port, DB9 male serial port. You can see here. This will uh, connect the female uh, serial port. So, yes, we just connect this adapter to this uh, serial to USB converter yes here it is so now i will connect the rj45 connector to the uh, cisco console port you can see i just connected the rj45 port here and the the usb port i will connect to my laptop's usb port here it is so now i just uh, connected uh, the console cable from router to my laptop to access the cisco router or switch through console cable we need an emulator software like party i prefer party uh, we can easily download party from internet go to browser and type uh, download party party uh, 64 bit windows 10 Okay, we can go to party.org. Here you can say download party. Just click here. Uh, we can uh, download party installer dot uh, msi or you can download party uh, party dot exe. So this time I will uh, download uh, installer dot msi. Just click and it's asking save. Just save it. Yeah, it's already been downloaded go to download location yeah just uh, double click it and if I if we press run it will be installed so I have already I am just canceling it for this time because I have already uh, installed party you just uh, run and go next 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 then it will be installed now I will access Cisco router through party before doing that I have to check the com port number uh, to check the com port number just type here device manager device manager go to device manager and uh, then uh, go to port here you can see usb serial com uh, com3 so the port number is 3 we check that the com port number is 3 now we will open party double click make sure you select the serial and uh, we'll type uh, com port 3 and then open and just press enter here you can see uh, uh, router so we successfully access the router we'll go to privilege mode enable yes so we successfully access the cisco router through console cable and uh, emulator software party now i'll show you how to uh, change the uh, party text color and background color and how to uh, change the font size Mm, to do this uh, you have to uh, right click here and go to change setting and uh, click colors and uh, to change the font co uh, text color we'll select default foreground then go to modify for if we want to uh, change the text color from white to 
uh, it's currently white so if we want to change it to green we can adjust uh, custom color so we just uh, make it a little bit deep uh, yes that's fine so press ok and uh, if we press apply you can see uh, now the text color is been changed so if you want to change the background color again uh, right click here change setting and click color go to background modify if you want to change the background color like uh, white so just click ok and apply you see the background is white and the text color is green if we go to configure terminal configure terminal say ok so exit so if we want to change the uh, If you want to change the text size so we'll go to change setting uh, click appearance and then go to change you can select the font style which font you like a lot of font for example we choose uh, uh, fixed days and if we uh, for example uh, any any of the font courier we can change the size 12 so let's see apply you see the font size already been increased so this is uh, how we can change the text color the background and the font size so this is for uh, only for this session if we uh, close it then it will go to the default uh, white text and black background so I'll show you for example we close it yes and open it again it was comport 3 so if we open it again you can see the black background and the white text so if we want to uh, make the change permanently so we'll go to change setting for example we'll change the font size uh, for example uh, lucida console will uh, change it to 13 sorry 13 size okay and go to color the fo foreground color for example the green one and the background color modify for example white one okay before applying we have to go to session uh, for permanently changing the color and anything so we have to select the default setting and press save then apply you can see now uh, the background is white and the text color is green if we go to configuration terminal okay so ip interface brief sorry So let's see is it uh, permanent or temporary so you just close it okay and again open it open yes so now it's already been changed and it's uh, default by default and it's uh, permanently changed so so this is how we can change the uh, party um, text color and the background and the text size so if you think this video is helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and you can let me know any queries through comments. Your little appreciation will inspire me to make the next video. Thanks for watching.